The Badak is a modern addition to Indonesian land forces with design work undertaken in 2013 and serial production started in 2014, leading to a series introduction had in 2022. While just seven total hulls mark the series footprint within the inventory of the Indonesian Army, the design signifies the decided push to modernize Indonesian ground force capabilities for the long term. PT Pindad is responsible for its design and based the 6x6 wheeled fire support vehicle, FSV, on its existing ANOA Armored Personnel Carer, APC, detailed elsewhere on militaryfactory.com. The Badak is intended as a successor to an aging line of British Alvis Saladins, also detailed elsewhere on this site. Of the original 50 hulls expected, just 14 are now to be procured due to budget constraints. As a fire support vehicle, the 14-ton platform is intended as a mobile support solution, bringing to bear a 90mm main gun set into a Cockerill CSE 90LP power turret. The turret sits atop the light armored hull features fully suspended, double wishbone, large road wheels offering excellent ground clearance. Power is from an inline turbocharged diesel engine of 340 horsepower driving the conventional arrangement. Internally, the operating crew numbers 3, driver, commander, and gunner, while protection levels reach Stanag level 3, though this can be enhanced to level 4 as needed. The driver sits at front right in the arrangement with the commander and gunner in the turret. This sets the power pack to the driver's left in the hull. Operational ranges reach 370 miles on internal fuel and a road speed of 50 miles per hour is possible, allowing the vehicle to easily maintain its footing alongside a mobile, advancing ground force. Secondary armament is a 7.62mm machine gun as an anti-infantry measure. At each cheek plate of the turret are also seated smoke grenade dischargers in two banks of four launchers each, these providing a self-screening effect on the vehicle when inactive.